We begin with that breaking news in New Zealand. Now, this is still a developing story. Veronica de la Cruz joins us now with the very latest. Veronica? Well, Liz, in the past hour, authorities are now describing significant casualties in Christchurch inside two mosques where gunmen opened fire on worshipers during prayers. Local media now reporting the death toll could be as high as 50. Witnesses say one of the suspects fired for more than 15 minutes. Four people are now in custody, three men and one woman. We are hearing one one of the suspects, like you just mentioned, live streamed the shooting as they gunned down the victims. This all happened at the center of Christchurch, a city not used to seeing such deadly violence. I could hear screaming and crying, and uh, I saw some people were, you know, dropped dead. I'm 66 and never thought in my life I'd love to see something like this, not in New Zealand. Clearly, what has happened here is an extraordinary and unprecedented act of violence. Tonight, Facebook says New Zealand police alerted them to the live stream. They have removed the shooter account and the video. In a statement, they go on to say, quote, we're also removing any praise or support for the crime and the shooter or shooters as soon as we are aware. The news has worshipers at one San Francisco mosque on edge tonight. We feel scary now if something happened like in the mosque. We feel so scary now. Now, San Francisco police have stepped up patrols around those mosques and, of course, are asking the public if you see something, say something. At the Live News Desk, I'm Veronica Dela Cruz. Back to you.